Hello class, today we're going to be discussing the characters tab in Dialogic. So to start off, to make a new character, let's just name her character. And we have a few sections here. So we have portraits. So this is where we're going to add in our characters, images, their different poses, different facial expressions. Let's do that now. Let's say neutral or say default. And then the image. I already brought in that one. We have neutral. Let's add in another one. Say angry. And then I got my angry pose here. Obviously, we have the character name, which we wrote. We have display name, what the character displayed as. Add the color. Nickname, description. Obviously, we have portraits. We can select the default, the main scale, the main offset. Main mirror, whether we should mirror the image or not. Style, we'll get into that in a later episode. Typing sound, so if you want a specific sound for your character when they're speaking. So now, how do we add this character to our scene? Well, we can add a character by pressing this button. Let's drag her to the top, so she joins in. Character, and let's just give her default. And we have about five positions to choose from. But let's play this and test it out. So, so we press the button. There you go, she joins in. In position one. Hello, I'm angry. Okay. So that's position one. Let's say we want her in the middle. And she's in the middle. But let's say we want her more close to the screen. How do we do that? So we go back to the character. We can change the default here, or we can change it here. So, for example, I want her closer. So, let's say scale 150. And then we can offset her by on the X or the Y axis. So, I want her to be, let's say, more zoomed in and then a bit down. So, we just see, like, from the knees to the head. See what that does. It's a bit of trial and error, but she's still too high. Let's just say 800. Test that out. And there you go. I have her in a nice position. So let's say we want to change her facial expression. We can add another character. Let's go. So just say I'm angry. Not join. Update her. Change portrait to angry. And we can also change her position to, let's say, position one. And we can have, we have different animations here. Also, when she joins, we have different animations. So if we press this drop down here, we can change the animation to fade in, slide in from right, left. Test it out. So she bounced in. That's it for today's video. Come back next time where we discuss the glossary.